So tell me about the jump a little bit from Innova to MVP. I know you've been answering this question a lot on your, on your pod, uh, your pod tour, but <laughs> <laughs> tell me, tell me about the jump, whatever you can, you know, divulge and what, or whatever you'd like to uh, let the listeners know about what, how it benefited you and, and what you're getting out of it and, and what we can expect. Sure. Yeah, it's been, it's been a fun process. Um, I'd say I was a little hesitant to leave Innova for um, just because it was, I was in my comfort zone there and that's obviously a comfortable place to be, but I feel like I was kind of stuck in my ways also, you know, I, I wasn't posting, I wasn't doing this, I wasn't doing that. I was just going out there and, and throwing my, my T-Birds and my Thunderbirds and my AVRs and that was about it. And I felt like a switch, like a big switch, like a sponsor change could be a good time to kind of start putting myself more out there and, and looking at the, the social media side of the disc golf and treating it more as a career, more than just what I was doing. and. So yeah, the, I felt like it would have been easy to keep keep doing things the way I was doing if I stayed with Innova. And then MVP was really interested in helping me build up my personal brand. They were really interested in um, yeah treat, treating me like a like an MVP, if you will. But 